హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ దిస్ ఈస్ యువర్ ఫ్రెండ్ గైడ్ మెంటర్ ఫిలాసఫర్ స్కోన్ జయసింహ వెల్కమింగ్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ యూ టు దిస్ వండర్ఫుల్ పాడ్కాస్ట్ కాల్డ్ సెలబ్రేటింగ్ లైఫ్ వీ జస్ట్ గెట్ వన్ లైఫ్ అండ్ వీ లెక్ట్ సెలబ్రేట్ ఇన్ ద లాస్ట్ ఫ్యూ ఎపిసోడ్స్ వీ హెవ్ బీన్ డిస్కసింగ్ అబౌట్ ద ఇంపార్టెన్స్ ఆఫ్ అవర్ ఫిజికల్ హెల్త్ అండ్ ఫర్ దట్ ఐ సెట్ వీ నీడ్ టు హ్యావ్ త్రీ ఆస్పెక్ట్స్ ద ఫస్ట్ వన్ వీ టాక్ అబౌట్ ఫుడ్ సెకండ్ థింగ్ ఈజ్ అబౌట్ ఎక్సర్సైజ్ now you may be wondering what is the third aspect the third aspect is about taking rest you are right sleeping and sleep is so much very important like any engine after running for some time it requires rest our body to request requires rest to rejuvenate recoup and to start again and for that we need to sleep imagine you are driving a car for a long distance after 100 150 200 kilometers what do you do you stop the car near the dhaba switch off the engine you let it cool down again you start off so that engine can again uh, run efficiently aeroplane when it is going for long distance they stop somewhere so that they switch off the engines for them to cool down they refuel and they start again like that our body to requires rest Now the biggest question comes is how many hours do you need to sleep basically if you are a child you require almost 7 to 8 hours of sleep and adults like us we require maybe 5 to 6 hours of sleep enough as we keep aging we require less sleep reason being children they run they scream they shout they play they burn lot of their physical energy and uh, only when they sleep the body gets rest right and most importantly you need to let children sleep more the reason is the children grow in height the muscles become stronger the bones get strengthened only when you're sleeping so if you sleep less you end up becoming a short guy you want to grow taller then you need to sleep and most importantly adults like all of us today in the 21st century we got all bad habits we don't sleep on time and we don't get up on time so we need to develop this routine that daily at a particular time you need to sleep and same time you need to get up so what will happen is over a period of time the body gets used to this so when i was in the air force 10 o'clock in the night they would do light switch off so no one can read or switch off the lights or they can talk so compulsorily we have supposed to sleep at 10 pm so that has become part of my life even today wherever i am around 10 o'clock i will feel very drowsy but morning 4 o'clock i am up from bed then i am back with my meditation yoga going to gym and doing other activities as well so the discipline is very important today many people have got this problem called insomnia means they lie down on the bed but they don't sleep they keep tossing up and down on the bed particularly uh, the reason is because people they keep on looking at that mobile and the whatsapp they keep on looking at that instagram watching youtube videos chatting with people and they have a television in the bed bedroom and they keep on watching that television some people lie down on the bed they read now listen our body has got accustomed to one activity to one place like bedroom supposed to sleep puja room supposed to do puja kitchen supposed to cook dining table supposed to eat drawing room supposed to watch tv read newspapers or talk to people balcony you can have a cup of coffee study room supposed to study so you know one place one activity so when you people they do different things on the bed when you lie down on the bed bed is confused what i'm supposed to do now should i eat should i watch tv should i chat on my mobile should i read a book or should i start simply think only thing is when you want to watch tv sit in the drawing room when you want to read sit in the study room only when you want to sleep that's when you should go to bed bedroom 
and bedroom should be beautiful especially the bed should be neat and clean and no disturbance from the external sounds or the lights proper temperature and when you lie down on the bed you take a deep breath close your eyes breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out three times as you keep breathing out tell yourself relax relax and relax automatically you will go to sleep in case if you don't get sleep then what to do count the numbers 1 to 100 1 2 3 don't count numbers loudly 1 2 3 4 5 the neighbor will come with a gun to kill you so count in your mind why when you sleep our brain keeps on playing that video what happens is morning whom you met what you spoke what you heard what you read what you saw the one tar it video keeps on playing so when you count numbers they have no images and it is boring and instead of counting numbers brain goes off to sleep in case if we still don't get sleep then what to do count the numbers back from 100 to 1 definitely you will go to sleep in case you have done enough physical exercise you had proper food you are mentally at peace you had a proper bath you are wearing some comfortable clothing you are lying on the bed where there are no lights and you know nice beautiful aroma and uh, the temperature is okay you are supposed to sleep but sir all these things happened but i still counted numbers hundred back to one i have not been able to sleep that means you need to urgently consult a doctor find out what is the actual issue you may be having some medical problem maybe some worry so you need to understand this okay and sleeping is very essential okay for all the diseases okay deprivation of sleep is the root cause the quality of sleep is very important and also the quantity as well very important and if you get tired in a day you also can take a small little nap around 20 minutes in the afternoon we call that as a power nap all people who are very busy with accounts are working with machines giving some lectures physically exhausted and what they do 20 minutes in the afternoon they switch off the light they lie down on the bed close their eyes that 20 minutes of that you know power nap you get up and then brush your teeth change your clothes maybe you can have bath and you can start again a day this is called two dawn theory means dawn means early morning sunrise normally sunrise is only once for us but if you can use this you can have two sunrises so when you sleep you are switching up the lights closing the windows and drawing the curtain room is dark so brain doesn't understand it is a day or night the moment darkness brain thinks it's night it goes off to sleep and 20 minutes get up switch on the lights brush your teeth and get ready so many people successful people they have this power nap in the day and after that right they can again start the day afresh and with full energy as well so anyone who thinks that as a day passes by you are losing your physical energy mentally exhausted not able to concentrate take this small little power nap only 20 minutes don't sleep now again 4 hours then what will happen night time they will not get sleep at all so you need to balance your work and your sleep very very important for all of us and you know that with proper practice you can do anything and if you have early dinner no coffee tea before going to sleep we have light entertaining reading mind is at peace you are lying on the bed you will definitely go to sleep okay so very important that you have a good sleep if we don't have a good sleep it is going to cause lot of problems for our body and body when it doesn't recoup next day you are going through the motions but you still don't have proper rest at all that is the reason sleep is very essential and especially don't fight don't argue don't have any altercations with family members or outsiders before going to sleep you need to draw a line 
रात गई सो बात गई सो एवरी नाइट यू क्लोज द अकाउंट्स एंड देन स्टार्ट अगेन बिकॉज माय गुरु टोल्ड मी स्लीप इज टेम्पररी डेथ एंड डेथ इज परमेंट स्लीप मीन्स वेन यू हैव स्लेप्ट फॉर फ्यू आवर्स यू आर डाइट एंड वेन यू डाई मीन्स यू परमेंट स्लेप्ट हो इट इज लाइक दैट when you get up in the morning you are a new born person don't carry any worries any tensions start afresh life will be so beautiful and make sure that you have two times bath morning once evening once focus on the kind of food that we eat okay the reading that you do and also the peace of mind is very essential so the way you arrange bedroom very important as i told you earlier no television in the bedroom no mobile to carry there no reading lying on the bed no eating sitting on the bed no discussion sitting on the bed no playing you know caroms or chinny checkers on the bed you only when you feel like sleeping that's when you should go to sleep then automatically will get good sleep so many doctors they will advise all of us that you should have a good sleep so that little rest will help us to prolong our life so our body the muscles the bones the mind okay it's gets fresh strength again you can start off um, fresh again so very important that you have a good sleep so these are the three basic things that we need to take care many people they will have lot of money they eat choices food but they don't get sleep but you see the labor okay people who do manual work in the afternoon under the hot sun under a tree having eaten that rice and that mango pickle they will happily sleep in the afternoon so ask yourself who is the luckiest person having so much of wealth such a beautiful mansion so much bank balance so much gold so high you are in your position but still not getting sleep is that the life so the satisfaction is very important if you are not satisfied is going to cause lot of problems so we need to focus on the sleep people think that sleep will come automatically but you also need to get your body and mind tuned to the sleeping especially if you have a child at home from the engage groom them nurture them okay how to sleep things will become perfectly okay so guys this is the first aspect in celebrating life that you need to take care of your body and for that these three things are very important proper food proper exercise and proper sleep these three things will ensure that the body that god has gifted you with you can actually maintain it for the 100 years that is meant to to be on this planet if any one of them are not taken care that means body will stop working before that and we are responsible for that and you are there so the world is there if you are not there world is there or not there it makes no difference at all so you better have a good sleep and sleep which is of quality which is of good quantity which is essential for you and i'm sure if you have this rest everything will be okay so guys this is the first aspect we discussed and in the next podcast we shall talk about the other aspect having taken care of the body the next what you should take care okay that we shall discuss in the next podcast okay so until we meet next in our podcast keep celebrating life keep smiling so you are a gifted person and you have wonderful life just enjoy chill out okay love you all see you again jaisma signing off we shall meet up in the next podcast bye bye